if every day you lived as if Jesus really is alive. Imagine what it would be like if uh, those in your family, those you live with, who are believers in Jesus Christ, lived every day as if he lived in their life, as if he were alive, really alive. He is. Imagine what it would be like. Dream what it would be like if the Christian people on the job where you work or in the school where you attend would live every day as if Jesus is alive. Think of the impact. Dream of the impact that would make upon your life, those around you, and those that you work with. Imagine what it would be like if everybody in Rifle, Colorado, who claims the name of Jesus, who claims to be a believer, tomorrow and the day after and the day after would live as if Jesus is really alive. Imagine what a difference it would make. Now, I can't control what everybody in, Colorado, in uh, Rifle, Colorado does. I wish I could. If I could, I would say, you need to become a believer. <laughs> you need to trust in Jesus. You need to live as if he's alive because he is. But you know what? I can sure control what I do. It starts right here in my heart and in your heart. And my hope and my prayer is this week that you don't live as if you had a dead Savior, but that you live as if you have a risen Lord. Lord, we thank you for your word. We thank you for the truth that we find in your word. Oh, God, how it informs us, how it challenges us, how, Lord, it instructs us, and how, Lord, your Holy Spirit uses it to bring conviction into our hearts. And I pray this morning that there's anyone here that does not know Christ Jesus as Lord and Savior, that this might be their day of salvation, that after this music, that they might come forward and they might say to me, Pastor, I don't understand all this, but I want to. Please explain it to me. Please tell me what I must do to have this Jesus alive in my heart. And I pray for those of us as believers that, Lord, we would live this week not as if we had a dead Savior, but as if we have, which we do, a risen Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you for rising from the grave. Thank you for dying on the cross for my sins. And thank you for rising from the grave to bring hope and joy and clarity and victory into our lives. In Jesus' name I pray, amen.